Hey everyone, Eddie Gray here with thepipenote.com, back in the West Parlor here at Gray Manor. So I literally just like a minute ago finished um, making my last video, but I'm going to do a twofer uh, this you know, today and just post this later in the week, maybe next week. So I'm still smoking my Peterson 999 shape from their 9mm Dublin filter series. Beautiful pipe. Smokes really well, but what I've got loaded in it right now is giving me a hard time. If you're interested, it's Haddo's Delight. And it's weird, that blend seems to be really temperamental when it comes to um, packing. I haven't really dialed it in quite yet. But it also seems to do better in some, some pipes than others. Maybe tall, narrow um, bowls tend to work better. And this is more of a, a stout, you know, shallow bowl. So keep that in mind. It is a tasty uh, Perique blend. And you guys know I love my Periques. But that's what we're going to talk about today. This is something, I've, a video I've thought about making several times and just decided each time I'd rather not get, get into it. Uh, but I think now's as good a time as any. So my question is, is Perique, in fact, spicy? And at first thought, I'm sure a lot of you are thinking, well, yeah, of course it's spicy. But, um, you know, and I've heard that stated so many times, people talking about Perique blends they're smoking. And saying, yeah, it's spicy. You can taste that perique. That spiciness is really coming through. And I've always kind of been hesitant. I've been like, well, I mean, really? Is it really? Because that's not the experience I typically have with perique. Um... So I have some points I want to rattle through here. Um, first off, I love Perique blends. I've smoked so many of them, and it's very rare, if ever. I, I can't think of a Perique blend that I've smoked that I didn't like. Maybe the occasional one-off aromatic blend that might have a bit of Perique in it. But that's pretty rare in the market. I don't think I carry any, you know, aromatic blends that are, that have Perique in them. Now some examples of some of my favorite, uh, some of my favorite Perique blends. Cornell and Deal's Blue Ridge, Chenay's Cake, which is pretty heavy in Perique. On a bookshop, not quite as much Perique, but it's there. Old Joe Krantz, a little bit more Perique than the Haunted Bookshop. De Blonde Doro from Savinelli. Captain Earl's Honor Blend and Mystic Blend. Some of their other blends have Perique, but those are my two favorites. Peterson's Deluxe Navy Rolls. Phenomenal Virginia Perique blend. And many, many more. GLP's Penny Farthing has Perique and Old Dark Fired. And those are my two favorite component blends, or component pieces in blends. Now, 
like I said, most people say Perique is spicy. Um, that's one of the, the main attributes I hear. And typically, I don't get that. I get a dark, musty, earthy, um, plum or prune taste and smell. Depending on how much Perique is present in a blend. But it's not as zippy or zesty or spicy as, as to me, as most people say it is. Now, I can't argue with a person's personal experience. Um, that's not what I'm trying to do here. I'm just trying to explain how I experience Perique and why I love it so much. Um, all of those tones, all of those taste notes that I rattled off there, earthy, musty, um, dark, plummy, uh, those are all things that I, I really, really enjoy. Um, in Perique blends, and I think it's coming from the Perique. Um, I don't think it's coming from the other constituent or component parts. Maybe the interplay between, but, you know, if the Perique wasn't there, I probably wouldn't enjoy these blends as much as I do. Um, now, I've been told in the past that um, I have one of the best or one of the worst palettes in the world. <laughs> And I personally don't know which. Certainly, I can tell you it's not a trained palette in any way, shape, or form. Um, I just know what I like. Uh, maybe I need to dig into training my palette in the future, but it's not something I've, I've had time to, to seek out um, so far. Um, I, I also think it really depends on the amounts of Perique in a blend and the amount of other component parts in the blend. Um, if you have a lot of Virginia and a little bit of Perique, I think it might show up as spicier um, because of the Virginia though. I think possibly a lot of people mistake um, the tendency for Virginias to bite or to nip at you um, when it's being smoked. Um, and mistake that for spiciness coming from Perique. I don't know. It's just a thought. Um, something for you guys to think about and ponder while you're smoking Perique blends in the future. Uh, because Perique typically is pretty much almost always paired with Virginia in some amount. Sometimes it's just Virginia and Perique. And usually it's more Virginia than Perique. Um... And then sometimes there'll be three, four, five component uh, leaves in a blend. And Perique's there. But I think maybe the Virginia plays more of a part in that, that overall spicy feeling um, than people might give it credit for. Just a thought to, to ponder. Um, So yeah, I'd really be interested in the comments um, to hear what you guys think and your experiences with Perique. Do you like it? Do you hate it? Do you find it to be more spicy or more earthy? Um, or both? Does it depend on the blend? Um, those are all things that, that I would be interested in hearing from the community. But um, for my part, I know that Perique leans more towards that dark, fruity, plummy, earthy characteristics than it does the spiciness. Now, sometimes the spiciness is there. Typically, it shows up in the bottom half of the bowl as it, you know, the, the smoke naturally gains in strength or concentration. Um, and typically, like if I don't retrohale, I don't notice it as much. When I retrohale, that's when I get kind of that spiciness, which kind of leads me to believe that, again, it's that Virginia that's doing it. Who knows?
Well, I think that's enough to ponder for one day. I'm going to get back to this Hatter's Delight. Anyway, glad y'all got to see me, and we'll chat with you later.